This video was originally posted in Japanese on August 28, 2020, and has been edited into English. Good morning, Hero Wars fans. This video presents a complete survey of the team composition of the top 50 ranking members of Arena, conducted on the web PC version of Server 10. Since I didn't provide a comprehensive summary in my last survey video, I'd like to share with you what I've learned from my research on Server 11 and examine the team composition of the top 50 Arena players on Server 10. Now let's take a look at the results of the 8x playback survey with the full cooperation of Microsoft. In our last survey, we looked at Server 11 and found that due to the young server age, the adoption rate of heroes with hard to get soul stones and team composition was low. By the way, the top 10 most popular heroes used for team composition in Server 11 are, in order from first to last, Astaroth, Martha, Oliver, Nebula, Jurgen, Kark, Faceless, Lars, Krista, Sebastian, and Kira. 35 of the 50 adopted the Astaroth as their vanguard tank, while the 15 who rejected the Astaroth chose either the Cleaver, Aurora, Corvus, or Galahad as their tank. Also, if we limit ourselves to the top 10 players in the arena, only 3 of them include Martha as a healer in their team composition. Of the 7 people who rejected Martha, 3 included Celeste in their team composition and 1 used Thea as a healer. If you look at the 6 people who don't have a healer in their team composition, 4 out of the 6 have Kark in their team. When Kark is included in a team composition, the battle is often over in a short time, so it seems that many support members such as Jurgen and Nebula are included instead of healers. We will talk about how you can use this video series to your advantage. In this series of complete investigations into the team composition of the top 50 players in the arena, we have compiled a list of numbers with a one that will make your eyes hurt, with the full cooperation of Microsoft. In my opinion, the most efficient way to use this table is to first decide on one hero that you definitely want to have in your team, the main attacker, and then look for other hero combinations. For example, in my case, I want to use Kark, so I enjoy looking at only the 20 team members who have adopted Kark and fantasize about the ideal team composition. Also, the sooner you choose a hero to raise to maximum power, the better, so I hope you find this video helpful. Let's take a look at the results of this survey. As a result of this survey, 42% of team formations have Yasmin in their team composition. On Server 11, Yasmin's usage rate was 6%, 3 players, so it turns out that popular heroes vary by server. And in this Server 10, I think many people have Helios in their team to counter Yasmin. I think this is because the top ranked teams in the arena on Server 10 are using Yasmin, and the top ranked people are actively using Helios to compete with Yasmin. This means that the team composition of the top 10 players in an arena could change the combination of popular heroes in that server. Also, I think Celeste is very popular on server 10. I haven't summoned Celeste, so I don't really know the reason for her strength, but when 30 out of 50 people are using her, it's hard to overlook. Also, since the first and second place people on this server 10 adopted Celeste, it is possible that other people are copying them, thinking that Celeste is the strongest. Based on the above, I did not expect such a big difference in the survey results between the Server 11 survey and the Server 10 survey. As an aside, I'm sure many of you have seen articles on various blogs and videos that say that Hero is the strongest, but if the person who wrote that article only knows that server, it may not be an objective opinion. In addition, the various stats of the heroes have been adjusted, so no one combination is the strongest. However, I believe that Kark is the strongest hero, ha. <laughs> now, it's time for the video to end. If you think it would be better if I just show this table from the beginning, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching the video until the last part. I'll see you in my next video.